Hello and welcome to another video. So, yes, I've got a arm sleeve on. I had an injury when I was in the dojo uh, last week. Basically, what I was doing is we was going around punching the pads like we do, and we had and we had this new guy in at the same time. So he's holding the pads to me like that, and I'm going ninety to a dozen on these pads. And he's accident. He must have looked at the clock or something, but he's accidentally slipped the pad. And as he slipped the pad, I've come through and I've literally pulled it all the way through there. Oh my God, did it hurt. Okay, so everyone that found Roland Rat in that last video, this is the last time I'm gonna hide him though. So he was up there for you as well. And again, we're gonna put all the winners up there for you at the same time. So they're all scattered around for you at the same time. So I've gone out and I've brought myself a cookbook. Yes, I bought myself a Joe Wicks cookbook. So, and if you have a look, he's got a 30 day challenge on here. So I thought as I'm injured, why not review his book and why not go through it at the same time? So I will be doing this whole 30 day challenge, okay? So I'll be putting it into little videos at the same time for you, but he's got a whole workout plan, which is literally right at the very back, which you can follow at home in the comfort of your own home. So I am going to be doing that for the next 30 days, okay? And not only that, he's got the food plans to go with it as well. So he's got like, you can follow, there's loads of recipes in here. So I'm gonna follow some of his recipes along the way and I'll let you know how they are at the same time. Um, so, yeah, so he's the like, same as me, doesn't believe in counting the macros. It's just about getting your energy balances in at the same time and making sure you keep yourself moving. So we will get started with this now. So we're going to start with the home workout. It's all going to be body weight. I'm going to go through the beginners bit, obviously, because my arm is hurting. But he's got beginners, he's got intermediates, and he's got advanced on top of that. So what I'm going to do for the first week while my arm recovers, I'm going to go and do the beginners bit for the first couple of days. And then I'm going to move into the intermediates. And then hopefully my arm should be better to go back into the advanced because that's where I prefer to be in the advanced. So let's get this done. Okay, he believes in working out fasted. So I am fasted at the minute. Okay, so I'm going to get the first workout in and then we're going to grab the meal. So make sure you like and you subscribe and you hit that bell button which is down there because if you don't, I will stand on your doorstep. And I'll just do that all day. Jeez, that was really, really good. Uh, we went around that circuit, whoa, jeez. Three times, uh, 30 seconds of work, 30 seconds off. Like I said, I just did the beginners. I had to write it all down, but there was like eight exercises that I had to follow all the way through. And then I just repeated them three times around. Oh, I felt it on the third time round. But I tell you what, jeez, for a beginner's program, that's not too bad. So let's go and grab a post-workout shake, which he suggests in the book, and then we'll go and follow his recipes. Okay, so here's my post-workout shake. I'm just gonna have that, and obviously I'm using my protein as well, because I have to use my protein all the way through this. So I'm gonna have this, have a shower, and then he suggests an hour later that you get your first meal. So that is what we're gonna do. So let's go upstairs and get changed. Oh, I'm so happy. So I found some of the breakfast options, and so we're gonna make this one. We're gonna do the French toast first, because oh, I always make French toast anyway, but I can't put the banana on because I've got to get some bananas, so I'm gonna have to do some shopping, I think, after I've done this one. Okay, so this guy makes French toast just like me. So he's got four slices of low calorie bread. You have one egg, and then you've got 200 grams of egg whites, and then you've got a small handful of blueberries. Obviously, you need to have the banana on top of that as well, but I don't have the banana, but it says optional, so you don't have to put it on. Okay, so I'm gonna whip this thing up and see if I can make it exactly like, uh, well, he's made it, well, I'll try. And there it is. There's the maple French toast, cinnamon flavor as well. So he said put maple syrup on. So obviously I just put the skinny syrup ones on the top of it as well. So let's get this down me. I'm gonna to have to go and get prep up some food because I'm gonna go through some of this book with you very quickly. 
Okay, so I've been reading this for the last couple of days. It's a really, really good book. Obviously, you've got the exercises that you're going to follow in the back. So there's two lots of body weight exercises. And then there's two lots with the weights. Obviously, you've got the beginner, intermediate and advanced. At the minute, I'm just going for the beginners. And then probably in a couple of days, I'll move into the immediate, intermediates as the arm gets better. And then obviously, I'll go back to the advanced, which then, then finishing off 30 days in the advanced. So, yeah. Uh, his recipes okay so he's got a meal plan on there as well so obviously if you're going to do a fasted workout in the morning it's absolutely fine but then you need to get your post-workout meal in as well along with the shake so that is what i've just done now and then after that it's two low reduced carbs which is going to be low in carbs but high in fat and high in, high in protein as well so that's the, that's what you've got to follow uh, snacks it even says you can have i can either have 25 grams of nuts of my choice or i can have a protein bar it does not matter so i will probably pick and choose between the snacks at the same time uh but yes i'm just going to go down the road now because i need to go and get some stuff because there's a lot of prepping in this so it's like really good to prep up your meals as well it's literally just teaching you how to meal prep it's teaching you about nutrition i mean i so far what i've read of this i highly recommend getting his book so what i'm going to do is i'm going to run down the road because i need to go get some bits start prepping up so i've got some stuff for last me for a few days so obviously it's snack time so i got that wrong it wasn't 25 grams it's actually 30 grams of nuts of my choice obviously you're going to get all the healthy fats in as well i've got my pecans because i absolutely love these things so that's going to be for my snack for my second snack i'm probably just going to grab one of my grenade bars my protein bars but yeah so we're going to have this get this digested a little bit and then i'm going to meal prep uh lunch for you and show you what it is okay so just hit down the road quickly just to go and get some bits just to make a couple of bits i've got some more stuff in the fridge as well so what we're gonna do is we've got the red onion i've already cut it up can you not see i'm crying <laughs> you got the boom bang pepper and um, i've got the courgettes as well i've got some fat free greek yogurt i need 300 grams of this but i'm going to prep it because it always says you need to prep it so i'm going to make two of them as well so i've got one for tomorrow and then I have got some avocados, which I'll stick in at just there. All right, let's go and make something, because hopefully we are going to make, if I can find it, we are going to make that, okay, off that book. Nice and simple, ready? Let's get this thing done. So I'll tell you what, it's really easy. All you've got to do is just weigh it out. He gives you all the ingredients and all the weigh-in measurements, and all you've got to do is just weigh everything out, put it into there, and then all you've got to do is just cook it. And as you can see, this one is for tomorrow, this one is for now and then all you got to do is literally just follow that everything is all in the book so all you got to do is just literally follow it and there you have it this is his chili avocado look at that really really good only literally took me 12 probably 15 minutes to whack that thing together so yeah like that was nice simple easy to make so i'm gonna wolf this down Plus, I have one for tomorrow as well. So, like he says, you need to meal prep as well to make sure you've got stuff for the next day, which keeps you on track at the same time. So, I've got one there, and I've got the other half of the avocado in there. So, these will go into the fridge. So, all I've got to do is heat that up in the microwave, open that up, and just put it on top and add the uh, low fat Greek yogurt. Man, I'm stuffed as a button after eating all that. I don't think I can eat anything else at the minute. But it also recommends that you just get out and get as active as you possibly can. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just going to head out, go and get some steps in. Okay, so obviously I'm going to have to work this around my martial arts as well. Yes, I'm still going to be doing the martial arts. I'm just not going to be sparring and taking part in all the other stuff at the moment. Until obviously that's better. But yeah, um, so I need to time that around there. But I am allowed to have some more carbohydrate meals if I need to have them. For example, say I do my fasted workout in the morning, then obviously I get my post-workout, which is going to have the carbs in it. And then I'd have the lower carbs, which is moderate in fat, which is high in protein, which I'd have for my lunch. And obviously you've got your two snack items as well on top of that. But then just say I do martial arts in the evening, then I'd have to have another high carb meal straight after. All in all, the book is actually really, really good. So, I mean, if you don't know anything about nutrition and stuff like that, he actually does help you, everything's weighed out for you. 
all you've got to do is just follow the book and he'll give out all the measurements for you and all you've got to do is just cut it up prep it up it's really that simple so he also hates people getting on the scales which i do as well but i have weighed myself i'm sitting at that which was 200 pounds which is quite good for me you get when you go into a bulking phase and then obviously there's my photo as well up there but we're going to see what happens after 30 days so we're just going to follow this stick to my martial arts on top of that and we're going to see what the results are after 30 days so we'll just keep vlogging and vlogging all the way through that 30 days okay so it's dinner time so let's just make some chicken kiefs like i said you just follow that and you're going to be absolutely fine super simple chicken breasts kerrygold butter garlic parsley and some cauliflower rice and boom just like that this took a little bit longer because obviously i had to cook the chicken but once the chicken was cooked it was literally just putting it all together and there you go, it is chicken kiefs and there's your cauliflower rice which is there as well. So this is going to be my final meal for tonight. So we're going to call this video off here but so far pretty good. I'm only on day one at the minute so obviously I'm going to film the whole 30 days for this as well. Just I just want to see what my experience is going to be like with this as well. But obviously like I said if I need to take the extra carbohydrate meals I take the extra carbohydrate meals. I'm just going to play it by ear and just see how I'm training for the day because I know how I'll be training for the day. So I, obviously I'll be taking it easy because of the arm for the first probably week or two anyway and then hopefully I can get myself back into where I was and hopefully we just won't do it again but it's good fun so this was day one of literally doing his exercises on here and literally just following his diet plan on top of that i'm just might as well just review the thing see how we go but yeah so far very good so anyone doesn't have a clue about nutrition and stuff like that everything's in here so anyone that's like new to like fitness or anything like beginners just go and grab the book it's got so much information in that book and you've got all the you've got like recipes in there you've got like breakfast ideas lunch ideas dinner ideas there's so many recipes that i actually want to try as well for this whole 30 days so i shall see you tomorrow for uh day number two